Hey guys, Jared here. Now I want to talk about some of my presets that I'm saving as I'm at HQ right now, because I think it'd be really fun for some people to be able to dig into sounds that I actually use, sounds off my records. And I'm starting with a sound that I love hearing it back because I feel like I'm in the room again recording it. It's a song I have off my last record called Shadow Dancer. And these pedals were an integral part of that sound. Um, more specifically, I'm talking about the room sound, like that reverb. I'm talking about having that uh, Leslie, that that organ kind of sound on this. Here's the, the riff. I'm gonna uh, play it with you right here. So what's happening there is you're hearing like a, a clear overdriven amp, but you're not hearing, I, I, I wouldn't suggest that as an overdrive pedal, right? So what we did is we're on the amp right now, we're right, we're on the channel two, we're in the, uh, the channel two of blues power, right? It's, the gain is at about two o'clock, the volume's dimed on that channel, bass and middle are just uh, under noon, treble's a little push forward, I am playing my old Les Paul, so, it needs a little bit of help sometimes on that extra high end because it's 72 years old and it's getting a little tired sometimes. But we got that. We have reverb on the amp, which is just kind of the part of my sound regardless. So having that said, right, we went in and I went to this rotary and with the rotary, slow setting, jack that slow setting, right? Um, and the level is just kind of matching, right? But I was able to go in and I was messing around with the drum horn and the blend on that. And it's just really cool because it gave me such a top end distinct. It's honestly, it, I, to, to me, it feels like it's the whole kind of spectrum of you get all that low end. But you start to hear the brilliance of that rotary when you get up to those higher notes. Since you're playing the melody. But the bottom is still staying tight and retaining that. Going one step further, we're taking it to the next dimension. I added the verb, right? The verb pedal, which is basically giving me more of that sound of kind of going into the, the outer space, which is in that chamber setting. Mix is about, the, about noon, right? Dampens a little bit extra. We're at about two o'clock on that. And it's just, it gives you that extra dimension. Now what's cool about this sound is, yes, it pertains to that Shadow Dancer riff, but if you want to get crazier, that's where the plugin starts. That's, that's essentially where this preset starts for the plugin, sorry. And now I can add things to it. Like when I go to the solo section, as I would live, I would kick on my overdrive. That's where I start to kind of veer into where the preset goes, you know, is now when I go to that solo section, I kick it to the neck, right? Neck pickup and I'm doing the melody on the neck and it goes. <laughs> Click that off, we're back to the. So it's, it's kind of fun too to have these well-worn kind of trail points where it's like, okay, cool this preset right here, that is my sound for that. And then I can build off that. And I just love it. I think there's something really special and it's kind of haunting about, you know, especially with this riff, having that rotary vibe with the, the verb. I love it. Check it out.